Hello everyone, I am Jyoti Sharma. In this video, we will be talking about Matsya Setu app, importance of fisheries in India along with challenges in fisheries sector. Matsya Setu app developed by ICR Central Institute of Freshwater Aquaculture Bhuvneshwar with funding support provided by National Fisheries Development Board NFDB Hyderabad. This app compromises of species-wise of subject-wise self-learning online course module. This app will help farmers to connect with renowned agriculture experts who will explain the basic concept along with live demonstration regarding breeding, seed production and grow out culture of commercially important fish such as carp, mural catfish, scampi, ornamental fish and pearl farming. Dr. Aishi Varaman, scientist, Matsya Setu project ICR CFAS shared valuable information about Matsya Setu with Krishi Jagran. This app is an online course app. So basically what we have done, uh, we have recorded all the lectures, all the practical demonstration of uh, um, breeding, seed production and culture protocols of various different fishes varieties are there uh, we have complete video modules in uh, app so basically if you see like we have categorized the contents into carp uh, scampi uh, maral magur uh, and freshwater pearl farming and ornamental fisheries uh, everything is there inside so if you download the app you have to enroll to the courses so once you enroll then you will be having uh, separate video chapters in it this online course app was launched with the aim of disseminating latest freshwater aquaculture technologies for aqua farmers across India. The mobile app will help the fish farmers in learning about advanced technologies and better management practices at their convenience. This will help in turn influence the adoption of scientific methods in fish farming, enhance productivity and improve income. Matsya Setu app will also be an important tool to disseminate the latest information on different schemes among these fish farmers and assist them in doing business. India is the second major producer of fish through aquaculture across the world. It is also the fourth largest exporter of fish worldwide because it contributes 7.7% in global fish production. Fish exports account for 10% of total exports from India and about 20% of agriculture exports as of 2017-2018. Fisheries and aquaculture production contribute about 1% to India's GDP and 5% to agriculture GDP. The sector provided employment to 28 million people in India. According to Food and Agriculture Organization, 90% of global marine fish stocks have been fully exploited to an extent that recovery would not be possible biologically. Discharge of harmful substances such as plastics and other waste into water bodies also causes devastation to aquatic life. The online course also include better management practices that should be followed to maintain soil and water quality and feeding and health management in aquaculture operations. The modules have been divided into small video chapters for the convenience of the farmers. It also has additional learning materials. This app also offers quiz test option for self-assessment to enhance the learning experience of the farmers. After the successful completion of each course module, the farmer will get an auto-generated e-certificate. Farmers can also clear their doubts and get a specific advisories from the experts through this app. Dr. I. Shivaraman, scientist Matsya Setu project, ICR CIFA shared valuable information about how Matsya Setu app is beneficial for the farmers. In our country, the per sector productivity of our fish ponds is uh, pretty low. So, what we are aiming through this app is, so here we are teaching the best management practices. Uh, say for example like feed, how much feed you have to give to a fish for a culture period and how much fertilizer to be added. Like this, there are a set of best management practices for each and every species. It differs from each and every fish variety. Um, so we are teaching the BMPs or the best management practices. This is going to, if they adopt, if they adopt these best practices, that's going to improve their productivity in turn, um, it will increase their income. Let's hope this new app will help aquaculture farmers and students to learn new concepts and skills in fisheries sector and lead to more career opportunities in this sector which helps our country to gain new heights of development. For more daily updates, keep watching Krishi Jagran. Thank you.